yes so uh, hba1c is basically a glycosylated hemoglobin it's a 3 months average uh, diabetes sugar uh, you know indicator test this is to be done once in 3 months since the uh, range of it is going to be an indicator whether the treatment that you are taking whether the control that you have put in is working well or not so basically hba1c is going to be an indicator for your therapy whether it is working well or not so basically since we all know that diabetes is a chronic segment disease and it's only it's uh, never only about the high sugar it's much more than that so only controlling sugar will definitely not be the solution to control diabetes there's much more that comes when it is uh, when we're talking about the control of diabetes also there's a myth about uh, curing diabetes reversing diabetes so that is also not possible controlling diabetes would need a uh, a uh, uh, Com- a complete uh, solution comprising of uh, uh, lifestyle modification with good diet and fitness uh, also the treatment that your diabetologist is going to plan for you will play a major role in controlling diabetes and high sugar levels uh, the uh, diabetes control also needs a comprehensive approach with Uh, a good nutritionist in place who can help you to plan a multi nutritional therapy along with that you know the a good approach towards maintaining lifestyle you know it is very easy to achieve a good control of diabetes with a good lifestyle modification with a consistent uh, uh, you know efforts towards maintaining the same maintaining a good lifestyle with good weight management is also very important a uh, cessation of smoking consumption of limited amount of alcohol doing good uh, amount of fitness activity would definitely help our patients there are lots of myths and uh, you know uh, uh, myths about the diabetes and beliefs about the diabetes um, i think you can sit with your doctor and get them corrected properly